everybody, it's your friend Rigor Mortis back with a new video. I uh, haven't done anything in a while, so I'm so sorry about this. Um, work has been keeping me so freaking uptight. I ha haven't even had any time to game. Um, and ever since I started with my mixed martial arts training, um, I've been in spending three to four hours every day in the gym, or at least four or five times a week. So, um, it has been taking a lot of my time at the moment um, because I'm training. I'm trying to get a in fighting shape. I want to do my last fight, um, maybe for in the next six months. So I've been doing quite of a few things. Okay, but anyways, then don't worry about me. You guys want to hear about um, how did I fix my crew? Um, me and my buddies um, decided we gotta boot up the crew again and play it since the new DLC launched a few months ago so um, and we kinda got bored of all the other games that we were playing um, so yeah um, <clears throat> because I sit with a quite of a modern PC with an i7 and an NVIDIA high-end chip inside my um, notebook I've experienced some issues um, with my NVIDIA uh, drivers as well with Windows 10 and with some um, coding, um, CPU coding um, software and stuff like that, that has been conflicting with my um, the crew software. So I went to a lot of forums and read up quite a lot, and there was a few videos on YouTube, but not a lot that ex actually explain point to point what can you do and what you can look for um, when you have a problem with crew so I'm gonna go with with all the things I did to fix my crew so I can play the game again like normal everybody booted up like normal so the error that I was finding with my crew is um, if I go to my steam and click on the crew when it's here, it will open up in Uplay here, and then from Uplay it will boot up in the game. But then it will give me a black screen like standard, and then it will crash and say the game has stopped working, um, and it doesn't give me any um, options to troubleshoot and try to fix the problem like most other uh, errors does. Um, I try to go through my Windows error logs to see um, what might be the cause of this uh, crash, but they d didn't log anything in Windows error um, section, so it was quite strange. Um, um, so let me start now from the beginning what I did. First of all, I updated all my um, NVIDIA drivers. Strangely, now that with the newer driver updated, I can't see my NVIDIA uh, Express but it's supposed to be somewhere around here. Um, some people are, um, disabled the antivirus. I did not because I use Bitdefender, um, and I did not uh, disable my antivirus, nor did I do my firewall. But I updated my um, graphics driver to the latest one, as you see there. Okay. <clears throat> Second of all, so you don't need to disable any. Uh, antivirus or firewall protocols don't do that it's just unnecessary it's an it's some software issue um, it's not a, f a thing that's been blocked okay so first of all I sorted out my drivers I updated my windows um, to the latest updates now the thing that one has to remember when you do an update for your Windows. You need to have on your main drive at least 14 to 12 gigs of open space. Um, this will enable you to do the downloads. When you don't have any space on your C drive or on your main hard drive, your updates will not download and it will not happen. So, first of all, clear your disk, get your updates done. All right. Second of second step, install your crew via either Steam or Ubisoft right then you do the following you go to properties so wait let me just step again click on right uh, on crew highlight it go to properties then you go to local files and you 
go there and you verify the game catch. When this process is done, right, you go to my documents, which is there, and you scroll down and you find this file, the crew, right here, okay? This what you need to do is so straight out after the installation. Verify your files after the installation and then you delete that file, the crew. I know it sounds strange, alright? It was for me a total mindfuck, but trust me. Alright? You delete that file, you saw it's gone. And then what you do is basically go to Ubisoft, second step. Go to your setting sets, um, section, right? Then you untick this thing. Enable in-game overlay support for games. You disable for untick that box, alright? Then you restart your Ubisoft, uh, so it takes effect. The second thing that you need to change in your Ubisoft as well. Um, where is that one? Unlink your accounts, all right? Just you don't need it. Uh, I think that might be one of the issues. Um, ever since I did it, it actually take on, well. It, it responded quite fairly, and it, it uh, the game actually started working again. And this is after three or four days of struggling with the game, and I've actually got it to right. So let me show you now. I went through the same process now. Um, I actually put the old files back when I deleted it. Um, so let me show you the game will work. It will ask now of me, do I want to proceed? I just say launch the game, not recommended. And then, yeah, the game will launch introduction will happen and I will be able to play the game without any issues so um, let me just show you and verify and prove to you all that these steps are um, mandatory if you want to get your crew working I have absolutely no idea how did this happen with the coding or such or programming with the game how it fucks out I have no idea <coughs> but this is what I done to my machine and to my software section make this game work um, and I really hope it helps you guys out because I mean I struggled for three four days there you see the game boots up um, it didn't even get this far in. okay so you all can see the game boots up alright I just want yeah, and that's the crew Okay, so this is your friend Rigor Mortis. Back with another video, and I hope you guys really did enjoy this video or uh, did find it very enlightening. And maybe um, I really hope you guys can get Um I hope that you guys can will be able to play this game and enjoy it like like I once did. Um, so yeah, I'm signing off now, and I really hope uh, to see you guys around. If you guys did like this video, thumbs up. If you didn't like it, fuck it. Uh, I don't care. Thumbs down. Leave uh, some comments in the description below. Um, I don't really need you guys to subscribe or anything. I'm just a fellow just trying to help out anyone on the internet and any questions. Um, and if I come across with any errors or whatever, uh, well, I do spend some time and try to fix it. And this is me trying to give you guys some new information on a problem I had. So yeah, thank you for supporting my previous video on Overwatch, um, how I did uh, fix that thing. And I cannot believe I got so, so many views ever since the game I had the problem. I started the, fixing that problem when the game was still in beta. <laughs> and um, it's somehow still helping other people. I'm so happy about it. So anyways, um, cheers for now. This is your friend Rigamortis. And always remember to game with a smile on your face. Cheers, guys.